Inspectors are scheduled to visit Kekaulike Market again this week. They'll be trying to determine if vendors are making any progress in their effort to get rid of rats. The Chinatown Market came under fire last month after a videotape was released that captured a major rat infestation. KITV's Jody Leong has the story. A community activist shot this video of the inside of Kekaulike Market the night before Thanksgiving. It was a rat circus. Since the release of this video, Kekaulike Market has been under the microscope. Vendors say they've lost about 60% of their business, and they're trying to turn that around. They're putting in 110%. We're working every day to improve ourselves. If there's anything that needs to be done, we'll fix it. But during an inspection December 22nd, the health department found violations at 10 out of 14 stalls inspected. The violations mainly include roach infestations, rodent droppings, gnawed rags or paper, and holes in walls. The 22 vendors here are working with management to eliminate rodents and clean up the market. They're eliminating hiding places for the rats. And the drywall on the boat side, we took it off, so there's no way for the rodents to hide. If they do come out, we'll see, and it's more visible. He's clean. He's clean, yes, yeah. he's clean. Vendor Paul Min says they're also I sealing up everything. Early. He showed us the front doors that are now equipped with steel plates to keep the rodents out. If you could fit a pencil through, as the health department says, you know, rodents can fit through. And whatever space that we had there, they sealed it with the steel. Another problem area where the refrigerator line from the parking lot compressor enters the market. This entry point is also sealed off. They put a mesh screen behind, then they put the, this foam. Once the foam is dry, it becomes hard. hard. We walked through the market with men and found several dead roaches and gaps that could serve as hiding places. It's going to take a little time. Give us a time and you'll see a big change here. The health department has not issued any fines yet since vendors are cooperating. Inspectors won't tell us exactly when they'll show up at Kekaulike Market this week, but vendors say they'll be ready. Jody Leong, KITV4 Island Television News.